One of the biggest concerns is the possibility of up to 15 feet of life threatening storm surge. Our team coverage turns to local tents Christian De La Rosa live in Perry, which is directly in Idalia's path. Christian. Right here, Taylor County, you know, we've had several showers move through, but other than that, it's been quite a pleasant evening. So much so, it's starting to feel eerie. And really, that's the vibe among so many people who are sitting on the edge of their seats in anticipation of what Michael Lowry was just talking about, a potential catastrophic landfall right in this area. And by now, a lot of people have made the choice whether to leave, or stay. Prayers to everyone. As Hurricane Adalia gets closer. I'm, I'm just concerned about everybody. It's a scary time. Many people along Gulf Coast communities have been ordered by authorities to leave their homes. We met Janet as she was getting out. I've been here 30 years and I know that hurricanes can be vicious and water surges are the worst of the hurricane. Now Eric Kraszowski was boarding up a friend's business, but not his house. Are you going to evacuate? Uh, no. <laughs> and what are you doing at home to make sure you're good to hunker down? I'm doing nothing. I don't really have a problem with these. I'm living here for 30 years and hurricanes are hurricanes. What's gonna happen is gonna happen. There are a lot of your neighbors that are choosing to stay. That's their that's their choice. I think storm right now is a little overrated, um, but again, you can't take the chance. Ken Trufant lives this close to the water in Arequipa. Tuesday, king tides had already submerged some of the roads here. Wow. And in his wow. 30 years living in this home, he says he's never seen a hurricane like Adalia come to his shore. When we spoke, he planned to ride out the storm here, but wasn't sure. But what if we face another Ian like down south? That storm was supposed to come right over the top of me. Instead, it took a right-hand turn and went down into Fort Myers. North of here, in Taylor County, shelters closed amid the threat of Adalia's wrath. So Lovey Smith took a bus going inland. This is your only choice? That's my only choice, you know. Are you afraid of the storm? I'm afraid of the storm, but I'm afraid what's going to happen to me after this storm. 24 Florida counties along the Gulf Coast have evacuation order evacuation orders here in Taylor County. There is a curfew in effect. Live in Perry, I'm Christian De La Rosa, Uncle Tim.